Okay, we're rolling. <laughs> so what made you want to do a Karen Carpenter tribute? I've always been a huge fan of Karen Carpenter's. And uh, from the first time I, I heard her sing, I was sitting on the couch when a friend of mine said, Oh, you've got to hear this girl. You're just going to love it. Put the earphones, and I just absolutely fell in love, of course, with her voice. The tone, the emotion, the, the warmth. Uh, I just absolutely fell in love with the voice. But then the songs, too, and the way it was arranged, I wanted to sing them all. So I started to sing a lot of her songs. And... Um, Long story short, I about 10 years ago, I started thinking, one day I'm going to do a Karen Carpenter's tribute, uh, a Carpenter's tribute. And uh, there was a lot of things going on. And when we got off the ship, uh, we had been for about three years on the ship and just entertaining my own stuff, doing my own thing. But when it was like, okay, I'm I went back to my book of my goals and things that I want to do. Mm -hmm. And I saw that Karen Carpenter's tribute, and I went, this is it. I'm ready now. I want to do it. Because all her songs, I'm so comfortable singing her songs. They're right in my range, in my key. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, it's, it's like the songs were written for me also. I mean, it's just I just feel so comfortable, so good when I sing those songs. And um, when I started with the wig and the whole, it was, I, I was like, wow. And now the show is going great. People seem to really get a kick out of it and liking it and I'm loving it uh, every show every performance because I love the songs and so that's kind of how I got it